Hi, today we'll be learning about biometric system. Today we'll be talking about what is biometric, how biometric works, operating modes, type of biometrics, applications of biometrics, advantages and disadvantages, and finally the conclusion. Biometrics refer to the automatic identification of a person based on his or her physiological or behavioral characteristic. How does biometrics basically work? First, the sensor detects it, and then it's a pre-processing, following up with a feature extractor, template generator, and then it goes to the matcher, and finally, the application device. A biometric system can operate in two modes. One is identification, another is verification. There are two types of biometrics. First is physiological and the second one is behavioral. Under physiological, we have face, fingerprint, retina and iris recognition. Under behavioral, we have signature and voice. For facial recognition, first it captures the image. It finds face in image, extract the features and store them in template, compare templates and declare the matches. For fingerprint recognition, a fingerprint scanner has two basic jobs. It needs to get an image of your finger. It needs to determine whether the pattern of the ridges and valleys in this image matches pattern of ridges and valleys in the pre-scanned image. Next, we have retina recognition. Images back of the eye and compares blood vessel with existing data. We have iris recognition. Iris scanning measures the iris pattern and the color part of the eye. Signature verification is an automated method of measuring an individual's signature. This technology examines speed, direction, and pressure of writing the, the time that the stylus is in and out of contact with the paper. Voice recognition. Voice or speaker recognition uses vocal characteristics to identify individuals using a past phrase. A telephone or microphone can serve as a sensor. Application of biometrics is basically used in criminal identification, prison security, ATM and other financial transactions, PC or LN login, attendance, border crossing controls. This is example at the border crossing controls. Among the advantage of biometrics is, biometrics are generally used for authentication. It provides higher security, example like the iris recognition. Um, voice recognition works well over the telephone and it's user friendly. Example like the hand geometry recognition and fingerprint recognition. Disadvantage is, sometimes the retina recognition requires close physical contact of the scanning device, may not be generally accepted by public and it can be costly. Besides that, Voice recognition requires large amount of computer storage. People's voice can change and background noises can basically interfere with your voice. Biometrics features may change over time eventually and signature recognition has poor long-term reliability and accuracy difficult to ensure. In conclusion, technology is growing rapidly but at the same time, security breaches and transaction frauds are also an increase world over. All agency includes library who are in need of security and safety have to adopt to biometrics. Let us hope for a safe and a secure future. That's all for biometrics today. Thank you.